This is Tuna on Toast. Can I ask you questions about bad religion? Brett Gerwitz, mm, sure. 1988, okay. 89, 91, 93. He was in the studio with you on these early records. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we how, did our first record in three days for $700, no, $675. How did you link up with him initially? Well, he's Brett from Bad Religion. We heard, I know, but we heard like, he had why a studio. did he give a damn about you? Well, he had a studio. We were going to give him $675. Okay. <laughs> That was it. And so, okay, here's 675. You're working with him. So you and he were... has to sign no effects. And we sit, I was sitting, no, I'm going to do my own label. Right. So I put out our first record. That was a mistake. Boy, was that a mistake. Which part was a mistake? I should have signed with Epitaph earlier. Oh, okay. But then he produced SM Airlines. And uh, yeah. if it wasn't for Bad Religion, you know, I, I would not know how to do melody or harmony. I learned everything from them. I just, you know. I heard Suffer, and I listened to it a hundred times. Right. And uh, and then Brett was producing us, and Greg Raffin sang some harmonies on SNM Airlines. And then Ribbed, uh, yeah, that was it for me and Brett. <laughs> <laughs> he quit twice, and uh, I was I was in tears. Like, he was putting three-part harmonies on all our songs, which is great, but my voice is really out of pitch, especially on that record. So it just having more harmonies just makes me sound that much worse. I'm like, stop! And... Uh, we played a lot of chess. We played speed chess a lot. <laughs> That's Who weird. Won? Mostly him. <laughs> I've never beat him in chess. Come on. But speed chess, yeah. I beat him a few times. Wow. I don't know the strategies. Beat him in poker. I'll fucking I'll bowl you, Brett. I will bowl you. I'm a champion bowler. I'm not kidding. Mike, how did it how did But that was great. He ta- he taught me everything. And, you know, I la- I modeled Fat Records from Epitaph too. I worked there before anyone. Hope you enjoyed. Now hit that subscribe button. And for more Tuna on Toast, listen wherever you get your podcasts.